Hi, everyone, and thanks for joining me on today's Healthy Hustle. If your Thanksgiving was like most Americans, then chances are your gut has had a great deal to process over the last few days. And to be fair, it's hard not to let loose and indulge during the holidays when there's an abundance of comfort food, loving company, and festive vibes, which all make it really easy to overeat. And while your taste buds are celebrating, all that overeating leaves your gut fighting an uphill battle. In order to understand exactly what it is that holidays like Thanksgiving put your gut through, it's important to understand what the digestive system is, how it works, and how it adapts to such heavy loads. So let's take a look. Let's start by defining the digestive system. Technically speaking, it's a long tube that food and drinks pass through from the time they enter your body until the time they are expelled as waste. With that being said, the digestive system is a lot more than just a pipe that runs through your body. It is actually one of the most complex, impressive, and important systems in the body. Your digestive system, which is also sometimes called your gut, is responsible for much more than digesting food. It also contains bacteria that are largely responsible for important body functions and have the capability to affect the way your body absorbs nutrients and regulates hormones. These bacteria also play a role in your body's immune response, skin health, mental health, metabolism, and more. The way your gut functions is with a combination of mechanical and chemical processes. The mechanical processes involve the contraction and relaxation of muscles along the digestive tract. These are the movements that are responsible for swallowing, digestion in the stomach and intestines, and most importantly, the transit of food and waste products. These contractions also prevent the backflow of food. Meanwhile, the chemical processes in the digestive system are mainly facilitated by digestive enzymes that are produced by specialized cells along the gut. Digestive enzymes break down foods through chemical reactions at a molecular level. The main group of digestive enzymes are amylases that work on carbohydrates, proteases that break down proteins, and lipases that break down lipids. Once all of the food is broken down into the nutrients in their molecular form, those nutrients are then absorbed into the bloodstream. This happens mostly in the intestines, but can start as early as in the mouth and stomach. And just like that, what was turkey and stuffing is now proteins and carbohydrate molecules that are making their way into different cells all over the body to be used for a variety of functions. Now that you understand how your digestive system works, let's talk about what happens on holidays like Thanksgiving when we tend to overindulge. In a nutshell, when we overeat, we end up overburdening this already overworked system. Remember, we have both mechanical and chemical processes that occur during digestion, and both are impacted when your system is overworked. More often than not, enzymes and muscle contractions are the processes that are hit the hardest. The body produces and stores a limited amount of digestive enzymes at any given time. Remember, these are friendly helpers that break down the food you eat. When too much food comes in, we often end up with an enzyme shortage. On the mechanical side of things, when the stomach is too full, it can prohibit the gut muscles from contracting the way they should, simply because there's no room to do so. The result? Digestive discomfort in forms like bloating or indigestion. So the question then is, how can you get the system back up on its feet after taking such a hit? I'm about to share my favorite tips with you. So number one, watch your portions. I know it can be difficult to stick to, but watching your portions is actually the best way to prevent overloading your digestive system, no matter what time of year it is. Everyone's gut capacity and satiety levels are different based on things like genetics and activity levels. However, the general rule is that you should stop when your body tells you to. This may present itself as a reduction in your appetite or with the actual physical feeling of fullness in your stomach. Number two, pace yourself. While you're eating, take the time to slow down and truly enjoy your food. There's no need to rush. The simple act of slowing down and chewing your food helps you avoid swallowing too much air, which can impact the mechanical functions of your digestive tract. Number three, try healthier recipes. Remember, the quality of your food has a great impact on the health of your gut, as higher quality foods are going to be more nutritious and easier to digest. 
Trade processed and packaged foods for nutrient-packed whole food recipes that provide your gut and entire body with nourishment. Number four, drink plenty of water. We all know that being properly hydrated is good for our health, and it is especially important for our digestive system. Water helps with the breakdown and transit of solid food along the digestive tract. It's also filling, which means it's a great way to help keep yourself from overeating. With that in mind, make sure you drink plenty of water each day, especially during this busy holiday season. Number five, supplement with digestive enzymes. As you now know, digestive enzymes are small but mighty. They're responsible for facilitating digestion from the mouth all the way through the intestines, and they're made naturally by your body. However, as we just discussed, we can easily run into a situation where we don't have enough enzymes to get the job done, especially during the holiday season. And when we don't have an adequate amount of enzymes, we can experience digestive discomfort. That is where keeping an enzyme supplement on hand can be helpful. With an enzyme supplement, you can easily and quickly boost your body's natural supply of these important molecules so it's better equipped to get the job done. Number six, take probiotic supplements. There are over 1,000 species of tens of trillions of bacteria that live in your gut. These bacteria make up your gut microbiome and have a profound and direct impact on your health. As we touched on briefly earlier, the beneficial bacteria that reside in your gut microbiome are largely responsible for a number of important body functions and have the capability to affect your body's mineral and vitamin absorbency, digestion, immune response, and more. And sometimes these colonies of beneficial bacteria get wiped out, which is where probiotics come into play. These living beneficial bacteria help to reseed your gut microbiome daily so you can rest assured that your gut microbiome is as balanced as possible. Let's face it, we're only human, which means we're not perfect, especially when it comes to dieting during the holidays. If this is something you know you struggle with, then I highly recommend adding a supplement like Essentials to your daily routine because it really is a complete gut support packet. Essentials is a combination of beneficial probiotics that seed your gut with healthy bacteria, digestive enzymes that help break down and assimilate food, and organic wild microalgae, which is a wild superfood that is loaded with amino acids, essential fatty acids, vitamins, minerals, and more. Essentials packets contain the perfect combination of supplements to help you get your gut back on track and keep it there as you navigate the rest of this holiday season. The best part is you can put Essentials to the test risk-free with our 90-day money-back guarantee. You can learn more about Essentials and grab a box for yourself at the link in the description. Thanks for joining me today, and I'll see you next time on The Healthy Hustle.